For a year now, we've been following the journey of one Iowa medical marijuana patient. This morning, we're checking back in with Terry Clark about what she liked and didn't like about her experience with CBD. And Terry is the mother of our Tommy Clark. Tommy shares her mom's one big problem with Iowa's medical CBD program. You appreciate the time when you're not always in pain. Talking about pain is a daily dialogue with my mom, Terry. For more than a year now, she's allowed our cameras to follow along as she tried medical marijuana to treat her back pain. And just like the leaves change, so has her use of marijuana products. And it's like you got to keep taking it, but if you keep taking it, you'll be there every three days spending $100. Because of how much she needs to take to relieve her pain, both in tincture and capsules, my mom spends around $100 on a month's supply. Her tiny pink pills, oxycodone, costs nothing. If it was up to me, I would take it every time I was in severe pain, but I can't afford to go into the store and spend hundreds of dollars. She says tincture works best for her, but it doesn't last long, so she has to take more of it. I thought this would work as soon as they opened. I think I was one of the first ones there. I try it, and yes, it helps a little bit, but it does not take away the pain like my oxycodone. So she's setting down the products until she sees the strength go up and prices come down. Because when pain controls your every day, taking it away is top of mind. And right now, that means five pink pills a day. I will do whatever I need to do to get rid of this pain because I just want to be myself again. In Des Moines, Tommy Clark, KCCI News, I was news leader.